What is up everybody? Hope you guys are having a great day and in this video I'm gonna be showing you guys how you guys can log into ADP workforce So it's basically like a website where you can you know hire human resource like for your software or any analytical testing Basically, you can hire people from this website. All right, so that's basically what ADP workforce is So let's start the video on how you guys can log in But before I show you the way be sure to hit that like and subscribe button and notification on so you guys can get notified once our new video releases and if you guys have any question related with this video feel free to comment down below i'll be happy to answer you guys and let's start the video and watch this video until the end that's what i want to say because if you skip then you guys are going to get confused and i don't want you guys to get confused so i'm saying it again watch this video until the end without skipping so let's start first you want to go to your search engine it could be any search engine you want after you come to the search engine basically what you want to search for is once you search for ADP Workforce, what you want to do is where it says ADP Workforce, you want to click on it and it's going to take you to its website, all right? Now, once you come to this page, what you want to do is enter your user ID, okay? Now, after entering your user ID, basically what you want to do is click on next and after you click on next, it's going to take you to a page where you enter your password. And after you enter your password, if your user ID and your password matches and it is correct, then once you click on the login button, you should be able to log into your ADP account. But by some reason, if you guys weren't able to log into your ADP account, then basically your user ID or your password is mistake or check. Like sometimes both of them could be mistake as well. So do a check and after checking it, you should be able to log in. But let's say somehow you forget your user ID or your password. There should be a forget user ID button right below over here where you had to type your user ID. And there should be a forget password button right below where you have to type your password. So, you know, keep that in mind. If you forget any of those, you can click on this button. And after clicking on this button, it's going to take you to a page where you can reset your user ID and your password. But that's basically how you guys can log into your ADP account. So, yeah. And if you want to create a new account, you can always just click on create account. So, yeah, if you guys found this video helpful, then be sure to hit the like and subscribe button with notification on. So you guys can get notified once our new video releases. And if you guys have any question related with this video, you can ask us in the comment. I'll be happy to answer you guys. And I'll see you guys in a bit. Have a nice day.